Hello everybody, this is Maniac for Toys, and today I'm taking a Nerf review of the Elite Triad. This came out in 2013 and is able to hold three darts at once, firing one at a time. It works a lot like a jolt where you pull down from the bottom and fire from the regular trigger. It would actually alternate between each of them of which it would fire, and this originally cost about $7 in the United States. You can find this in a few different versions as far as color schemes go, but it's essentially the same thing all around. And you can still find it to this day around that $7 price, maybe even a little less. The Triad is a nice backup blaster to have around, so that if you need a, a quick way of drawing between blasters, if one gets jammed or just takes a while to reload, this is something you could take out right away. Already have three darts loaded into this, which is nice and easy from the front and be able to blast away. I, I know I did a little bit more jittery motion there because of switching hands, but you get the idea. It's easy to fire it and it rotates the um, air restrictor system. It's what's known as a smart AR, smart air restrictor system, where it would only fire one at a time, but it would know how to alternate between them so that it gets these two clogged up and this one with the most pressure and the most power behind it. So that way, you know, it, it, it rotates that. So it's not going to affect it all that much every time. You can even see, as I keep loading the same one in there, it's always firing from the bottom. Now it's going to rotate to the top one. Now it's going to rotate to the last one in there. It knows by a little bit of pressure in there which darts are in there and which one to focus on all of its spring power. So, it's very neat. It's something very common with Nerf Blasters. It's nothing unique to the Triad, but the Triad it by itself is unique in the fact that it can hold three at once and fire all three. Um, it's also very small for that, because if you got anything smaller than this, um, you would have basically a foregrip add-on that would go on to a larger Nerf Blaster that would only fire two, you would have, smaller than that, the Jolt, which is only going to fire one. Anything larger than this would be about a quadra, Quadrant and a few other variants. I know there's the Alpha Strike version of the Quadra, basically, that just released not too long ago. Um, but that's a much larger blaster and looks more pistol-like and might be harder to hold, you know, secretively compared to this one. So it's a nice in-between of having three shots and before you reload an easy way to you know, hold it back up and fire all through on a live long day. It's not a bad one to get. I don't know if it's really the best one to have as a backup. Maybe like a third backup? <laughs> like you would have something that's more pistol-like and then you would have this as the backup to that. Uh, some people would call that like a last stand sort of thing. So it could work in that sort of way. It did, it did come with three elite darts, so you have it right out of the box, ready to go, firing all three at once. It's direct plunger like a lot of Nerf Blasters nowadays, so it's very good at trying to deliver the most pack uh, punch, you know, kind of feeling to any of the, the darts themselves. And it gets pretty good range. I know in my testing I've done it to where it's about 20 feet or so, but some people have reported between 50 and 75 feet which is decent for something this size. And it's pretty cheap. Not too bad to get. I know there are some cheaper options for Nerf Blasters, but it, just a little few more dollars ain't so bad to get something like this. It's a good little backup. Thank you for watching this review. Hope you guys enjoyed it, and let me in your thoughts in the comments below or any questions you have. I can answer them down in the comments more about the Triad. If you want to see a certain Nerf Blaster reviewed, leave it in the comments as well, and I will talk about it on a future video. We'll see you next time with more Nerf reviews.